Hey guys, it's uh, Kevin from the Big Board. Let's uh, look at Fasalis and try and get a feel for what's going on. And I think, um, in fact, I think we should start at the other end of the battlefield. So let's pop down here. Uh, we had a series of uh, to and fro battles here, uh, you know, skirmishes where various cohorts were mixing it up. And as you can see, it's a fairly varied mess. Um, most guys are uh, out and in amongst it. Although the, uh, you know, the recruit level Caesarian forces here are, are in good shape and probably what I should have done is doubled them up given that uh, the Cretans here are being fairly aggressive. Uh, further along the field, we've had uh, the veterans sixth here uh, push hard against the Macedonians and inflict some pain, as have they done the same thing uh, against the Syrians as well. So that uh, uh, turn one disaster continued. And moving along the, the map, as we wrapped up the turn, uh, you know, it struck me that the only way the Syrians and, and indeed the Macedonians can, uh, and this this division, uh, well, this uh, legion here, the 17th, the only way they're going to survive against a veteran legion is if they uh, double up. So uh, we began that exercise near the end of the turn. <clears throat> and even with the, some of these veterans that had been uh, taking a bit of a beating, we've uh, brought in the third line. So as you can see, there's nothing in reserve, and it's uh, it's all doubled up. And we will either hold or die. And given that uh, Pompey has 50, 54 points of damage, uh, route points accumulated, uh, it's kind of do or die time. And uh, Pompey attempted to seize and failed. In fact, he succeeded, but uh, Caesar intervened and uh, uh, trumped him. And then he really just uh, conducted one attack here, which was unfortunate. It uh, didn't go well, and he is now reduced, you know, the equivalent of reduced anyway, uh, in the Simple Great Battles of History uh, mode. And we uh, reorder, redress the lines along here, uh, fearing the worst that well, I think these veterans are going to attack. So uh, wrapping up down here, the cavalry didn't do a lot. There's a lot of guys there. We're trying to maneuver them in a position. They didn't have much success down here. We lost a prefect. He's going to have to uh, come back on next turn. So. Overall, a uh, fair to middling turn for each side. I think the lines look fairly static uh, compared to turn one. So we'll uh, get this up and then we'll get on with turn three.